Welcome to PC Widgets Tech Talk. Today we're looking at the OCZ Vertex 2 SATA 2 3.5 inch SSD. That's right, 3.5, not 2.5. This is one of the rare first versions of a solid state drive in a 3.5 inch version. This is a 120 gigabyte version that we're looking at today. However, it does come in different sizes. These are the specifications for it. Okay, and it's basically no different than the specifications from a 2.5 inch SSD, to be honest. If you look at it, these are truly very, very fast. And um, obviously, what the main benefit about having a 3.5 inch is not just the fact that it has the same stats, but also when you install it in your desktop, you will not need the bracket, right? So in the box, all you get is the manual. That's it. And the screws so you can attach it on the side. Because of its width, it just fits in there, no problem. Okay, so uh, there you go. There's the SSD itself, very lightweight, not heavy at all. It's pretty uh, slick, the construction there. And um, well, very easy to install, like I said, no bracket needed. So that's pretty straightforward from uh, OCZ. These SSD drives are really the way of the future, right? Solid state, no moving parts, just Basically, the SATA connector is there at the back. Plug it in, format it, away you go. You don't even have to defrag these drives, right? Everything is taken care of. Here is my test system that we'll be um, using this in. And we're going to start off some benchmarks with, of course, the Addo Disk benchmark, because that's going to really give us an idea of if it's meeting the specifications of the drive when it comes to the read and the write. So if we look at the results here, we're getting about 255, 58 megs per second on the right. And on the read, we're definitely reaching 280 megs per second. So right on the money there for that. The Everest disk benchmark also showed here when I compared it against two other SSD drives installed on the same machine that the OCZ Vertex 2 is indeed the fastest of the two other ones. Actually, if we look at the stats here for the OCZ 263 on the linear read and uh, and the buffer read and the average access time of uh, 0 0.08 milliseconds, it's very, very close to the um, MX Technology 120 gig, which I reviewed recently. Very, very, very close in the results. They're both using the Sandforce um, controller. Now, Crystal Disk Benchmark here, we got the uh, sequential read and write. So there are terrific transfer rates of 220 megs per second you can see there on the sequential read and the write so very good results HD tune 2.55 gave me some benchmarks as well on the minimum max and average megs per second and again it does go over the 200 megs per second with a terrific access uh, access time of uh, 0.1 milliseconds so right on the money there as well as per the statistics the specifications that stated that it was 0.1 milliseconds as well on the random write you can see here how it fluctuates randomly writing to the um, SSD drive good results there as well terrific low CPU utilization which is what you want because of its uh, construction the way it's made the technology and as well when we look at 3d um, 3d gaming PC mark vantage 64-bit uh, has tons of different results here to compare against when it comes to uh, gaming importing pictures uh, starting up and there's terrific results here on the bandwidth how much it's actually you know loading in mega megs per second basically compared to two other drives which I had also installed on the same uh, machine so terrific results there definitely recommend this it's a super fast drive no difference between a 2.5 inch really it's giving great results and I definitely recommend it the only thing is that you can install it in a notebook so really I have nothing else to complain about it's a terrific SSD drive if you're looking for fast performance on SATA 2 and I'd like to thank OCZ for providing it and I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching